Hey guys, it's Adam, and for my last Switch Update video, I decided that I'm going, where is it, that I'm going to hook up my Switch to my TV. So, let me find the dock, and I will get on that. <laughs> um... There, oh, I already signed it out over there. So, I think you can see everything over there. Should be able to. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead, turn this on. Um, let's look on. And I now have two hands, so I should be able to do this. Um, okay, so, Basically, this thing. So I need to hook up the AC adapter and the HDMI. I have an HDMI over here. I still need to get the AC adapter. So I need to add this to my plethora of plugs over here. very neatly in there. So then you okay so my TV is on right now and uh, let's get this first look. Oh wow. Oh my goodness. Oh it works. So you saw me just put that in, uh, and it should just, that is insane. Okay, so I'm gonna position this a little bit. Okay, so now here, where the magic happens. Look at that. So now I can sit here. Just play away. I need to change the video settings a little bit because it is kind of misproportionate. TV settings. Oh wow, yeah. Uh, I think that's good. Yeah, stereo. Um, okay, so video <laughs> settings are all good now. Um, I'm gonna go ahead, I already opened up Bomberman, so I'm gonna go stick that in. position it so you can see what I'm doing. So actually I heard that with the Switch this is their first console where you actually attach the game cards where the art is facing the back of the console. So 
or the front of your of pet kennel. And it does click right in and out like a DS game would. Okay, so we're back. Uh, so, yeah. So now I finally have a game on there. So yeah, this is pretty cool. I like that. That's awesome. Uh, I'm gonna attach it to the Joy-Con grip. Right now, I just have them loosely out. You see how that feels to actually move around the thing with that. I really do like the Joy-Con grip. One, there's one complaint that I have about the Joy-Con itself, and actually maybe two. Um, one is that the wrist straps are very hard to remove. And the other is that um, the shoulder buttons are just so small. Um, I don't know if you can see that with the lighting I have right now, but look how thin that is compared to my thumb. Like, that's thin. Um, normally, I keep one finger on the, like, normal button and the other finger on the trigger button. But now I can't really do that because it's too smashed together, but I can live with that. That's an easy thing to figure out. So I'm going to use my capture button and picture of that and now we should be able to yeah find out there so that's back where we just were so how is everyone doing I like this this I'm gonna have a fun time so thank you guys for watching that was my tour of the uh well not really tour but the showing of the Nintendo Switch on the TV Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.